This is Off Ramp. I'm Queen of Kim here at Golden State on Fairfax, right across the street from Cantor's, where I'm going to go and try the beer float. So I'm a little hesitant, I have to say, because it's not really a combination I would think of. People have always appreciated good ice cream. What I think that people haven't appreciated is good beer. Mm -hmm. And I think beer just took has taken a bum rap for the last 50, 60 years. But the new you know, emergence of the craft beer movement has made the, the, uh, an average consumer realize that there are these uh, panoply of flavors that are possible in these beers that you had, you know, were never before uh, able to get or aware of. All right, here we go. Hmm. Well, that bite just tastes like beer. Right. All right. So. Now that bite tastes like ice cream. I'm not really feeling the mixture. I mean, it's it's interesting because I thought. I'd, I thought it'd be really strong flavors, but it's not. No, it's pretty subtle. Um, I mean, what I think eventually is going to happen is as it melts together is the ice cream will kind of lend a sweetness to the beer and the beer will end, lend a bitterness to the ice cream itself, kind of like the way bitter chocolate works together. But, you know, when taken separately, you're just sort of like, oh, wow, that's, you know, they're just two disparate things. And then it comes together, you know, it should be coming together pretty soon that you're like, okay, I get what's going on. Yeah, it just tastes like sweet beer, but it actually sort of works. Yeah, it sort of works. I kind of like it too. Is this sort of like a novelty thing you have on your um, menu, or do you actually just sometimes come in and go, I really want a beer float? It's actually funny. I um, This is the most popular combination. Brown bread is by far our most popular ice cream. Um, you know, the Rasputin is the beer that people clamor for, so this is the one that we make the most without a doubt. But the beer float that I actually want the most, and I love, are whenever we have some sour beers on draft, like, you know, Lawfully or a Fall Wild they or any of these Flemish sour beers, and then you put in a fruit ice cream with that, like we had, I think, a guava yuzu, and we had a raspberry uh, balsamic recently, and those ones, to me, those I get a craving for from time to time, but I'm not a huge chocolate and vanilla person myself, so I'm more of the all fruit flavors, so as a result, the, this beer float, while the easily the most popular is never the one that I want but I do love the combination of those fruit flavors in the sour beers to me those are absolute winners let me just take one more sip here mm. I have to say pretty good for off ramp this is Queen of Kim